Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, uh, welcome to the Daily Grind. How you doing all this morning? Good. I hope, I hope you're having a great day. Hope you have a great morning. Let's get crack lagging. Listen, if you're going out tonight to celebrate New Year's Eve, have a good time. But if you like this, don't be driving, man. It won't be good. Get somebody else to drive you. And now that we get that out of the way. <clears throat> 365 have gone by again. I hope you enjoyed some of it. Listen, don't take life so damn serious, man. We ain't getting out of this alive, so enjoy it. Live, have some fun, lighten up. Good God, man. It ain't all about stressing out and paying bills and doing this and doing that. and Lighten up. Rule number 62, don't take yourself so damn serious. Calm it down, calm it down, big boys and girls. Just loosen up. Listen. It's New Year's Eve. Time to reflect back and say, life is good, man. Life is good. And if you think that you spent way too much time being way too serious last year and just doing too much business stuff, then lighten the hell up. This year, spend more time enjoying it. I know. You got to work, pay the bills. I know. I get it. I get that. That doesn't mean you can't enjoy life at the same time. Life is meant to be lived and enjoyed, not worked through and stressed over. It's meant to be lived and enjoyed and have fun. Just take a break. Listen, when you go, when you check out, when you leave this earth, there's still going to be stuff in your inbox to do. Oh, man, hope that don't stress you out too much. Especially you OCD is that got to have everything done. That's just the way it is. You're going to die, and there's still going to be things that need to be done. Guess what? Somebody else will do them, or they won't get done, and the world will keep it on a trucking. <clears throat> the world isn't going to stop if you do. If you stop and take a break and let the world dance around you for a few days so you can enjoy life, you're going to feel much better. You'll be more productive. Imagine that. Even more productive. Because you're rested and relaxed. You're thinking clearly. When you're just going, going, going all the time, you're stressed out. you got a lot of crap in your mind, so you're not as productive. Henry Ford. Henry Ford was the one that came up with a five-day work week. They were working six days a week. And then taking Sunday off to go to church. And he said, listen, we need a day to worship, yes. But people need a day to themselves to get their own stuff done. And he says, if you give people a day to get their own stuff done, a day to worship, they're going to be more productive at work. And he was right. However, he should have took that a little farther. He said, we need four days off and three to work. Come on, Henry, now. You could have done better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, my point is, lighten up. Loosen up. Enjoy life a little bit. Life's not going to end if you don't get everything done today. It's okay to take some time for yourself and enjoy life. Matter of fact, that should be a priority, is learning how to enjoy life more. Because like I said, you're only going to go this way once. Uh, I know too many people that checked out way too early. They were going to do this and they were going to do that. When I retire, I'll do this. And they never made it that far. So you know what? I'm doing it now. I don't give up. Yippee doop doop da. I'm going to enjoy life now. Why? Because I'm alive now. So enjoy life now. It's okay to lighten up and have some fun and enjoy life. It's okay. And if anybody tells you different, tell them you know some wacko that does a daily grind and says it's okay just to have some fun once in a while and get over it, chummy. Uh, that's just the way it is. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. If you go out tonight, have a good time. Be safe. But if you're drinking, please don't drive. And if you're driving, please don't drink. Call somebody. Get a taxi. Do something. Get home safe so that uh, we can talk to you tomorrow. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Happy New Year's Eve. Over.